Okay, welcome to part two of how to multiply any number by the number 11. So if you remember in the last part, the last video, I walked you through how to do two digit number multiplication by 11. It's pretty straightforward. If you remember the technique I taught you is you start with six, first digit six, and you put the other digit at the end and you add these two numbers up, add these two digits up and you get seven in between. Now that is easy as long as uh, you know these two digits add up and you get a single digit. Now what happens when you have uh, 66 times 11? So let's do this again, six. And the last digit is gonna be six, but there's something in between which is 12, uh, right? Six plus six gives you 12 and that is the wrong answer right that is wrong because uh two digits when you multiply two digits with these two digits you typically get you're supposed to get three digits as your final answer so let's see how we solve this for now so you go 66 times 11 let me change the color again you have six in the front and six in the back and 12. so when you do 12 you're only supposed to put one digit here so you put in 12 like this right and you add these numbers up now and you get seven two six now let's check that technique again so when you have these two digits and it adds up to a two digit number then this is when you apply this technique so let's do this 66 times 11 traditional multiplication you get 66 and 66 and it adds up six plus six is 12 six plus one is seven right so same thing, six, six, just you have you have to shift this 12 and add that and you get seven to six. So that's how you do uh, multiplication of 11, uh, where when you add these two digits up, you get uh, not a single digit, you get two digits. So let's try something else. Uh, 92 times 11. So let's do the same thing. Nine, two, nine plus two gives you 11. And when you add this up, you get nine, two, one, 10. 10, 10, 1, 2, right? Uh, 1,012. Let's try that again. 92 times 11 gives you 92. 92, 2, 11, 9 plus 1, 10. Yeah, same answer. So this is working. This formula is definitely working. A little more harder, and that's why I didn't teach you this in the first video, because it's a, it's a nuanced technique. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Three digits, oh my God, this is gonna be a little more harder. Let's try this. Um, it's gonna be a different technique. We don't use uh, three digits all the time, or I haven't taught you three digits so far. So let's do this. First digit is two, five. And the technique is when you do three digits with, uh, when you multiply three digits to 11, you're supposed to get four digits as answer, uh, back as an answer. So here, um, what we will do is add five plus one, which is six, and two plus one, which is three. And that's supposed to be answer. So you just add these two numbers, these two numbers together, these two numbers, and you get two, three, six, five. Let's try this again. Two, one, five times 11, just to make sure I get this right. Two, one, five, and then you get two, one, five here, and you get five, as you see, six, three, two, and this is the same answer, two, three, six, five. Let's try a much more tougher problem where, uh, you know, just like our two is what happens if you get a much bigger number in between? Let's try this now. 973 times 11. Okay, now it gets really hard. This is probably the hardest uh, in the series of multiplying with 11, but bear with me. This is how you do this. You go start with nine, you end with three, because that's the first digit and the last digit. Then you add these two numbers together. So there are two more numbers here, uh, sorry, two more digits here. What do you get when you add these two numbers together? Seven plus three, you get 10. Now you have to add these two numbers together, correct? Uh, and you get what? 16, so you do this in your head. So when you get 9103 in your head, you say, I wanna shift these two numbers 16 onto this side, you get 10, seven, zero, three. This is the hardest thing to do in your head, but you can do it. So break it down into two problems. Like I said, first step is just add these two digits. You get 10, just doing this. 
and put that there. You sh add these two digits, shift it all the way to the uh, to the left, and uh, add that add that number in your head. It's a little more harder, but more fun. This is where mental math, where you build your muscles for mental math. You have to do it in your head, and once you start doing this. I promise you, rest of the math is going to be much more easier. We're going to do much more harder problems down the lane. But let's try this and see if this actually works. So 973 times 11 gives you 973 because 973 times 1 gives you 973. And then let's try this, right? So there's 3, 10, we got those two digits, right? 1, 10 plus 7, 17, plus 1, 10. So you get it? That's uh, exactly how you do three digits and that's why this is a little more complicated but you know fun to do let me stop this for now